Hi guys, I'm Bill. I invented the Brat Pack. Um, just want to do a quick demonstration to show you exactly how um, I like to use it, but there's a bunch of different ways and we like to encourage people to use them any way that they see fit. Um, Brat Packs are made out of really rugged, durable material. Um, the materials that I chose to have this manufactured with actually are used in mostly high-end backpacks and, uh, and hiking gear that you probably find in most like outdoor retail stores. So, this one's full, this one's empty. Let's take a look at the empty one. Um, if you'll see, it's got a little plastic carabiner on here. Um, it can actually double as a teething tool for your kid, um, but that also tucks away. I like to use that and hang it off a stroller handle. When you open it up, it's got three Velcro slides. Unfolds into the changing pad. Just made out of ripstop nylon. It's very tough, very easy to clean. Um, you can machine wash this cold. Um, I typically usually just wipe it, uh, wipe it down, and put it back in the bag. But you can machine wash cold and hang dry if it does get messy, and it most likely will. Spot for wipes that's labeled here. Spot for diapers. It's also got a clear um, ripstop uh, plastic pouch that you can put all manner of things in. I'll show you that in just a second, and it folds up easily. So I fold the pad first. Then the stuff on top, fold it up like a burrito, and you're good to go. It's got a pocket on the back. It also has a very, very small loop that you can use for a small bottle, maybe the size of a creamy bottle, but know that this is not insulated, so you're not gonna be wanting to carry milk and or formula for long periods of time. It's also got a molly system on the back. Um, the military actually invented this. You can attach this to anything using the same system that's basically just integrated webbing and Velcro and snaps. You can button or buckle other accessories too. Um, I usually put spare pins in mine. Um, and then it's also got a small strap on the back. This is usually how I choose to carry it. Um, that way you can kind of go hands free if you want when you want to have your hands available to take care of your kid and not carry all that stuff. So here's a full one. It's got space for about three diapers, maybe five if they're small newborn diapers. Um, never leave home with just one diaper. I've made that mistake before. Um, if you leave with one diaper, you will need two diapers no matter how long your trip is. So we um, actually included um, a small uh, plastic welded pouch that you can keep wipes in if you want to buy the large bag um, of wipes and put those in the plastic pouch you can. I usually use just like a travel pack of wipes. So there's two diapers in here ready to go, and then you can put whatever you want in here. I always make sure I've got at least one snack, a pacifier, maybe some um, sunscreen that's safe for baby, um, some chapstick, and usually some hand sanitizer, because you're gonna need that. Also, I like to carry um, a small thing of plastic bags, the same kind of bags that you use for pet waste, um, because that comes in very handy when you're throwing away uh, diapers on the fly. So, um, again, Fold the diaper changing pad side first, fold it up, and just whip your Velcro around. And that's all you need to take with you.